The Korean baseball organization's champions will be crowned after a seven-game finals dubbed the Korean Series. It's game two between the Tucson Bears and the SK Wyverns. We have our Sobobin out at Chamishil Baseball Stadium to bring us all the excitement. Apobin SK won the series opener. At this point, how is the atmosphere ahead of the big game? Hi, Daniel. I'm out here at the Chamshi Stadium, and the atmosphere is starting to build up ahead of Game 2 of the Korean series between Tucson Bears and SK Wyverns. There's still a while to go until the game starts at around 6.30 p.m., but a lot of Bears and Wyverns fans have filled up the stadium. The weather is quite cold, but that won't put off any of the fans here at the sold-out stadium in Chamshi. Tucson had their advanced directly to the Korean series with the league's best regular season record. SK Wyverns finished second in the regular season and had to defeat Nixon Heroes in the playoff to earn their spot in the Korean series. These two teams last met in the Korean series 10 years ago when SK defeated Tucson by winning four straight games in 2008. And the Wyverns got off to the perfect start this year, beating the Bears 7-3 in the first game of the series on Sunday. So, Bobin, what can we expect in this uh, familiar showdown between the two very familiar foes? Well, for today's game, the starting pitcher for Tucson Bears is the right-hander Seth Frankoff against the SK Wyverns Moon Sung-won. Tucson with the number one starter Josh Lindblom on the losing side on Sunday. The pressure is now on Frankoff to deliver a stronger performance to keep the Bears from going down 2-0 to zero at home. Daniel, I will keep you updated with the latest scores in a later newscast. Daniel?